Hello everybody, thanks for joining the Hardcore RVers coming to you from beautiful Wauweep Campground and RV Resort in Page, Arizona. My beautiful wife Renee Black. Yeah. Yeah. So we've been here for about six days now, getting ready to leave here to go to Brigham City, Utah. We'll lay over there for a couple days and then from there we're going to go to Rollins, Wyoming. And a couple days there and we're off to Yellowstone National Park. Yeah, it's in Cody, Wyoming is where we're going to rig in there. Hopefully, from there, we're going to go see some of the No Prep Kings Street Outlaws in Morrison, Colorado. That's kind of our goal, so we'll keep you guys in a loop. It's kind of been a daunting task. We've come up against a lot of things, some tire issues, some electrical issues. Um, some physical I'm, issues. Physical issues. <laughs> Sun's been beaten down, but we've had a great trip here. We went and spent one day down on the water, did a little swimming, and uh, the water level is low, but don't let anybody fool you. There's still a lot of water out here. And a lot of boats. A lot of boats, a lot of great people. We've met some cool people along the way. So, for sure, we uh, rig out first thing in the morning at O Dark 30, and uh, we're going to start hitting the road. It should be a good eight-hour drive. And uh, what we'll do is give you a good idea by uh, taking you around and showing you the lake. We'll panoramic the video around so you guys can see everything that we've been able to enjoy. Hope you enjoy it as well. Go to our YouTube channel. It's Hardcore RVers. R V apostrophe rs hardcore rvers look us up you guys can follow us subscribe and also you'll be seeing our posts on facebook so please say comments anything uh, that you'd like to see places you'd like to see us go uh, questions you might have in regards to uh, different things to utilize at your campground we'll do all that we can to share those things that we've come up against and maybe uh, answer some of your questions so we look forward to hearing from you guys we're so thankful i love my wife and we'll see you in Utah. See you in Utah. Hardcore RVers back at you. We are at Waweep RV Resort and Campground. It's beautiful up here, you guys. I mean, we have a full water view. We couldn't ask for much more than what we've got. Got my beautiful wife. You can kind of see what we got our little display right here for our kids. A little bit of grass. Our attack dog. I'll give you a quick walk around right here. Been up here for about six or seven days. Everything's loaded up so we can rig out first thing in the morning. Stackers loaded. Like I've told you in uh, other videos, uh, we have the golf cart upstairs in the stacker and the beamer down below. Everything packs in there pretty good. We're about 14,000 pounds loaded out. Just got to put the gate up and We'll get ready to roll. We do have to take the wheels and tires off the golf cart to get it up in there, but it all works. Man, look at that view. It's been awesome. It really has. Met some really cool people up here. We have a 90 foot pull through spot, all desert on the back end. Take you guys around this side. You know, it, everything does look good, but I'll tell you what, this living on the road, it's got its own complications and you better be cut out for it. And it does help if you're mechanically inclined because if you're not, you're gonna be throwing a lot of money at somebody that is. So I'm thankful for all the things that I've learned through the years that my dad has taught me and it helps me be efficient in this hardcore RV life. We'll end up packing in all of our puppy pin and all that stuff tonight. That way we can leave out of here in the morning. There's Dominator. You guys a quick rundown. Look at when we're sitting on our patio, we have all lake view right there. It's absolutely amazing. Kids just enjoy themselves out here. And the mom enjoys herself out here. Yeah, a little glass of wine, some red beer. We're truly blessed. Thank you guys for following us and supporting us. And uh, we th we're thankful for all your questions and all your comments, even the bad comments. We'll take those too. All right. Keep reaching out to us. We thank you guys. God bless.